We do begin tonight with the frightening scene today at one of the busiest airports in the country. The emergency landing at the Charlotte airport, the Delta pilots in the cockpit who got a computer signal that their front landing gear was unsafe, then flying by the air traffic control tower, where from the tower it was confirmed that the landing gear was not down. Passengers told to brace for impact, and this was the moment the plane landed without the landing gear. Inside the plane, the sounds, the images, and then moments later, you can see right there the applause for the pilots. The shaken passengers getting off the plane on that emergency slide right there. At this hour, that runway is still closed, causing flight delays and cancellations, adding to the thousands of disruptions already this week, as you know, because of other issues. ABC's Gio Benitez tonight on the computer alert for the pilots that the nose gear was unsafe, that flyby that confirmed it, and of course the passengers who were texting loved ones from the air. Tonight, tense moments inside that Delta flight from Atlanta to Charlotte with 96 passengers. An emergency on board after the front landing gear failed to deploy. Passengers told to brace for impact. The pilots carefully touching down. Seconds later, a loud bang as the plane's nose hits the ground. That Boeing 717 screeching to a halt. Passengers erupting in applause. Edward Cates filming on his phone from the front row. You started to smell smoke and see a little bit of smoke in the front cabin. Uh, and then within seconds of seeing and smelling the smoke, we were all kind of applauding the landing. Crew members calmly getting people off the plane. Come this way, leave everything, jump and slide. Jumping down the emergency slide. It was about the scariest damn 30 minutes of my life. Sean Osment was sitting in the emergency exit row, fearing the worst. I shot a uh, text message out to my mom and my dad, told them I loved them and to keep calm in case anything happens. Amazingly, no one injured. Federal authorities now investigating why the landing gear malfunctioned. They made a flyby by the tower so the tower could actually look at the nose and see what the problem would be. The gear doors were open and it was the wheel itself that was jammed up into that wheel well. They would have to land and slowly let the nose come down onto the runway. That runway shut down, delaying hundreds of flights. And David, those pilots first got an alert in the cockpit about that landing gear. So again, they flew by the tower so that ground crews could take a closer look. Now, of course, those passengers, they are praising the pilots for that incredibly smooth landing. David. No question. That was great work by those pilots. Gio Benitez leading us off tonight. Gio, thank you. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.